back to another video. This thing was requested by my cousin. Okay. <laughs> and, and, uh, sorry, I had to chat with my mum there. Hope you didn't hear what I was saying. And we're going to punch the dough today. And cousin, if you're, if you're watching this, your request is complete. Now, three, two, one. But, but it didn't, I thought it, it. Push it around a bit, it'll deflate. You go in there, ready? In there. Use a flower in your hands a little bit. And then push and up and up and up and up. Can you feel it deflating? Now there is garlic bread in the oven, so sorry for the background noise. And my mum told me how to mix it, so you have to put your hands in flour and then push and up again. Push and up again. Push and up. Again, push and up. Again, push and up until all the surroundings of the dough are pulled in place. And then do you punch again? No. Um, now it's time for kneading, which is like putting, which is like punching or fighting the pizza dough. So ready? Fault. Fault. Not deeper cuts. There needs to be more ninja in there. Go on, more ninja. Go. <laughs> and then you fold. And then punch. Punch and fold. Punch and fold. And sprinkle a little bit of flour on there. Punch and fold. Punch and fold. Punch and sprinkle a little flour on there. Punch and fold. Any non floured bits you sprinkle flour on. Punch and fold. Punch and fold. Now that should be enough. Okay. Next. Now what you're going to do is do this, but instead of your fist, instead of your fist, you do it with the heel of your hand, like this, and fold, and fold. Now any sticky bits or goopy bits, you sprinkle flour on and flatten. Palm and fold, palm and fold, palm and fold, palm and fold. Now you switch it over, which is folded. Okay. That is not a flowery bit, so it must not be in there. Palm and fold. Palm must not be in there. Palm and fold. Palm and fold. Palm and fold. Now that's a goopy bit, should not be in there. So you put flour on it. Palm and fold. Palm. Now just go to like, if you want to skip this, uh, go to where, go to somewhere in the video to skip it. So what, so we're going to roll it as one thick flat. With a Spanish extra V. No, I'm not going to tell you the name. Ready? Let's do this. Here is a trick to make the thing into a big circle, like Mum's one. Fold here. Here. Oh, mistake. Here. Here. Here, now flip it. Not a very good 
circle, but it'll do. So what we're gonna do is roll the pizza dough as a circle. So I'm rolling the pizza out and it's, this might take a long time. Now that we've made a big circle, I'll show you how to make the crust that is on many pizzas. the crust we did so I managed to fix it on the tray and mum forgot to turn the oven on because it was making too much noise in the background and now our garlic bread is not ready well I think it's ready should we have a look Okay, is it? I think it might be. Oh, oh, it's been off long enough to have a quick look. Let us have a... <gasps> oh! And garlic the garlic bread. bread. Now mum's going to show me the fork trick. My mum's going to show me the fork trick, which is a trick that um, will make the air or the sauce go up so it will cook better so double so mum's like did a fork thing to where i can't go past so ready let's go Twenty-five minutes. How much is that? Now for the other oven glove fight. <laughs> and the crocodile's knocked out. Oh, crocodile lost. And the blue guy wins. Yay! So what we're going to do is do um pizza. Um, so stay, so this is pizza dough making part one, stay tuned for part two, and garlic bread making will be in part two, and we will see you soon. 